So it's my birthday week. I wanted to dye my hair. And that's pretty much all the explanation that's needed for this intro. Here we are. My hair is all brushed and frizzy. Is make sure to cover your surfaces around you. Like get all your carpets up, put plastic down pretty much. So that you don't, you know, if you happen to splatter, you're not going to stain your tile or your walls or, you know, whatever. What I'm going to be using is L'Oreal Paris Ferreira? 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 It is in the shade Deepest Violet. The number is V28. I have used this color before and um, I did not use any color lifting products like bleach or anything like that. On the side here it shows whatever color your hair is, that's what color your purple is going to come out as. So mine normally comes out around here because that's pretty much my color there. Anyway, in this thing it comes with... Excuse me. It comes with these little flimsy gloves here. I've used them before, I do not like them. So I have this, these Sportex Color Bright gloves that are latex free because I'm allergic to latex. Make sure to read the instructions all the way through and figure out what you're doing before you start because once the process starts, it starts and you cannot go back. I'm not doing all over, I'm probably just gonna do the underside of my hair and a couple, maybe a couple streaks just because I'm not that adventurous. Number one, get ready. Be sure your hair is dry and unshampooed. Yep, we're good there. Drape dark towel over shoulders to protect clothing. As you can probably tell by my clothing, I really don't care. This is a work shirt. The entire back of it, it's just, it's just paint all down the shirt, so I don't really care. Eh, blood. Now I'm working on separating my hair with a chopstick. It doesn't need to be perfect. I'm pretty sure hair is not rocket science. This is what we're going to do for the main purple on the bottom. It's gonna be done like a so. This is what we're working with in the back here. Hey guys, how's it going? Immediately after mixing, squeeze color from bottle onto dry unwashed <laughs> We're good there. Hair, work mixture gently through hair from roots to end. Use as much mixture as needed to saturate hair. Let's get going with it. They don't snap very well. Come on, let's go. Let's go. I was smart and forgot a brush. So we're just gonna go for it. Oh, great job, Liv. You guys can put that in the comments. I'm trying my hardest not to get it on my skin. Oh, <laughs> get it on my skin right as I say that. I know. You probably can't see what's going on. I promise you I'm putting color on my... It looks red. I promise you this turns into purple eventually. See, you can see the back of my neck, how it's turning purple. I don't know if you can see that. Can you see that? Yep. Mm -hmm. This is probably why it told me to put a towel on. Time to dye like two feet of hair. I promise I brushed my hair. It's just being a little kooky dook. I really need a haircut. Look how long my hair is. Wow! Ooh, there's some brown string to get away. Ah, ah, I'm a king of New York. Oh my goodness, look at my neck. <laughs> What happens when you dye your hair by yourself? Is it just me or does it smell like chemicals in here? <laughs> I'm sorry if this is boring for you guys. I just realized that this is the second week in a row I've done a I did this myself to my appearance. If you want to know what last week's video was? Well, I pierced my ear. Wow, aren't you so amazed? Go check out that failure. Which I actually was told by many people that it didn't really look like a failure. So, thanks to those people. I think this is good enough for now. I don't know. You uh, let it incubate for 25 minutes. Over. And fold it over. Ah! Perfect! Don't you 
like my new hair? I was actually doing a, a tin foil look, not purple. Something I would like to do. The tips of the rest of my hair. Mm. Am I brave enough? Hmm. I don't know. The blah blah blah. Mm. Can't really get it off. Come on. Mm. Perfect. Here we go. Gloves back on. Okay, so that just happened. What if I did that again? So I'm just squeezing some in here. This is my own version of balayage. Not doing it right, but oh well. You know what kids? I'm just going to let this happen and um, I'll show you the finished results tomorrow, okay? I am currently packing, so you're just gonna have to forgive the mess. Here's my hair in the back. I don't know how well you can see it. I like to go subtle, but you can see the difference there. And the stuff I did over top ended up being um, ended up being very subtle because I um, I didn't leave it in as long as the underneath. But. There's underneath. You can see a little bit of the purple that I put over top and the stuff underneath peekaboos out. I don't think that there's quite enough purple for what I was going for or what I was hoping for, but I'm still pretty happy with what we ended up with. Like I said, I wasn't looking for a huge change, just something subtle, but just different, something. I'm so happy with it. It's not perfect, but I did it myself. Super cheap. This was only like $8, so. Make sure to comment down below if you guys like these kind of videos, because last week I did the whole ear piercing this week, I did the whole hair dyeing. If you guys think this stuff is fun, I might keep doing stuff similar to this. If you like my new hair, it's, it's subtle, but it's, there. <laughs> oh boy. But if you like it and you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to become part of the Water Down Tribe, just go down below, punch that red subscribe button, and jingle that bell so you'll be notified every Tuesday and Friday of 2018 when I post. Please check out my social medias, and I will see you on the flip side. I love you so much. <gasps> Bye. Snap off and snap off. Oh well.